hello friends welcome to my channel go digit uh, today in this video we will learn about a new payment service called paypal uh, will be available in new version of business central wave 2 and how we can use our service in this version we can see that now so just click on the search button and type payment service so uh, well before that i would like to show you one thing here when you click on the setups and extensions just click on extensions and here you will get to see that uh, paypal payment standard service extension is already or you can say pre-installed in this version so this extension is not available in navigation program 18 by default you can install it uh, uh, by manually but in this version it is coming uh, pre-installed so now we will see how we can use this service or extension in our sales invoices so before that just click on the search button and type payment services click on that and now uh, you will see the by default uh, payment service is still showing as demo sandbox account paypal but what we have to do is just click on new and when you click on new system by default suggesting you a payment service called paypal payment standard because this is the only extension which is coming as pre-installed the system is auto suggesting you this default option now before enabling this feature let me input the account id here well because i do not own any account in the paypal so i will just write any random do not reply at nav.com okay so if you have any uh, account in your paypal services then you can input that account id and password like things but because I don't own that, so I'm just typing here a default account ID or dummy account ID. So after that, just enable this feature. It is showing me some terms and conditions. Just click OK. Now this is an another uh, field which is which named as always include on documents. If you go into the highlight highlight area of this field. You will find that it specifies if this PayPal account should be included on all of the documents by default or not. So I will say as yes. I want that a PayPal link will be included in my documents by default only. Okay. So it is showing me some prompt here that PayPal payment standard has been enabled to have invoice status updated to paid when a customer has paid contact your system administrator to enable api services okay we do not look forward for this right now just click close and now you will see that our new payment standard or payment service of paypal is available here okay so just click escape and now click on sales and click on sales invoices what we will do is that we will create a new sales invoice of customer let's say 10,000 let me input an item here so let me input quantity as one here the price will be as let's say 100 So now if you go into the invoice details section 
you will find a field called payment service and it is showing me the name as paypal's payment standard see because we have uh, in the paypal payments in the payment service card we have uh, checked the always include on documents option so that's why it is auto suggesting in the sales invoice okay so if you have any other payment service option then you can always select that and you can select from there but i will use this only now after uh, preparation after you complete your sales invoice uh, what we will do is that we will go for releasing the sales invoice and then we will do the posting of the sales invoice guys uh, we can also use this post and send option in case you have a licensed version of the office 365 account because in that case you have if you have a an outlook installed in your system then what system what this new version will do is that where after the posting of the sales invoice system will directly allow you to send a sales invoice uh, to your customer with a paypal payment link in there from navision only or should i say business center only but because i don't have the license version of the outlook in my system so i will not use this post and send option but i will click on post only so let me click on yes and now the invoice is posted and it is uh, suggesting me to open a posted invoice card i will say yes now this is the posted invoice card now i have to click on print and click on preview and see in the posted invoice report of sales invoice system is uh, copied the paypal link here in the report uh, only so that when you send this uh, report to your customer when you send this invoice report to your customer so customer can directly click on this link and give you the payment online only so this is the best option uh, when it comes to online payment in the this dynamics 365 business central wave 2 see guys it is uh, right now a note is coming here in this link that this is a test invoice therefore no actual money transfer will be made right because we are using the Cronus test version and also we don't have any uh, PayPal account uh, uh, so that is why it is showing us this note if you own a authenticated account in your PayPal in the PayPal services then you can input that and you can provide this option to your customers so thank you very much guys if you really like this video please click the like button and click on the subscribe button also and kindly subscribe my channel thank you so much